practice of maritime cyber security. What are the maritime cyber risk management approaches? How do ships and shipping companies manage cyber risk? Also, what is the representative safety management system that ships all over the world have in common? Finally, how will each shipping company determine its cybersecurity procedures and implementation? We will find more answers to this question in this module. The shipping industry has built its own management system to implement and maintain ship safety. In particular, the ISM code is representative safety management system that ships all over the world incorporate and is based on international conventions such as SOLAS Convention. Shipping companies can implement cyber risk management by establishing the procedures and implementation matters related to cybersecurity and reflecting these on ship safety management system. The application and operation of the CIA, the three elements of security, to such separated information assets is the essence of cyber risk management. Examples of frameworks that systematically organize the three elements of security, the CIA, include ISO 27001, an NIST cybersecurity framework, and PIMCO provides guidance based on NIST CSF. We implement and manage this control model through CSMS. Cybersecurity Management System is a comprehensive system to protect the organization's cyber assets by establishing management procedures and processes and continuously manage and operate them. The Cybersecurity Management System is recommended to be integratedly managed by SMS. By establishing a Cybersecurity Management System that utilizes risk management methodologies and cycles, we can expect that security risks that have been sporadically managed are continuously and systematically managed. The CSMS consists of the following steps. Policy setting, management scope setting, risk management, implementation and follow-up management. The risk management system is established by preparing a policy and operation organization, identifying assets and establishing the scope and purpose of managing assets, analyzing and evaluating risks to prepare alternatives and management measures, implementing, reviewing, and improving them. The cyber risk management system are organized in following order. Number one, ensuring policies and organizations. Number two, identifying cyber assets and vulnerabilities. Number three, performing risk assessments on identified assets. Number four, establishing measures based on them. Number five, checking and improving them. The cyber management system can be divided into administrative security, physical security, and technical security in terms of its implementation. We will examine the details according to this division.